All right, what up? Solomon, I can only hear back with another League of Legends commentary, doing some more unranked diamond in the top lane this time, We're playing some Aurelia. This is episode number 37. We are cruising along. We are in... Let me get the refresh on the op.gg so we can see who we're against. We're in gold three right now. A couple games ago, I got promoted from gold five. I was gold five, 72 LP. Then I won one game, and I got promoted to gold three. So my MMR is quite good right now. And, oh, well, actually, everybody in this game is, like, similar to me in MMR. Or, in like, rating, rather. Actually, no, that's a lie. There's, like, platinums and... Okay, right now there's, on the enemy team, there's a plat 5, a plat 4, a plat 4, a plat 5, and a gold 3. And then on my team is me, gold 3. There's another gold 3, and then it's a plat 3, a plat 5, and a plat 5. So relatively close. Relatively close. But, yeah. We're playing against Yasuo, so I'm going to dumpster this kid. Let's Oh, move in. yeah. Oh, yeah. Hit him with that all gold everything that'll get him to leave. Also play Tank Eve. <laughs> all gold everything. Dude, I can't even listen to that song. Like, I like I like uh, Young Thug, but all gold everything. That one's just... What was that guy's name? <sighs> Trin I don't even remember what his name was. Like, the definition of a one-hit wonder. Alright, definitely want E first in this matchup. If he dashes forward, we can E him. Get a nice E auto, E trade. You can even auto first to pop his shield. A nice auto, E auto trade. Make sure we get our autos as we kite back. I have more sustain than he does, so these trades are good for me overall. That was a really good trade. <laughs> Forced out his potion already, nice. So we traded one potion for one. I just have to make sure he doesn't do too much shenanigans right here with his level two. Power spike, and we're good to go. So I already forced out his potion in exchange for just one of mine, so. Mission accomplished. Just gotta sit back, farm up, hit my level two. Good to go. Oh, that sucks. Pretty unfortunate. How that worked out. Make sure we get that auto attack on the way out. It's pretty important. Alright. Wait for the wave. Alright, got my level 3. Looking hot. Alright. In a much better position now. Probably gonna pass up on that creep. Should be a super easy kill. That is fine though. That sucks. Oh my god, dude has literally 20 HP. Damn. That really sucks. Okay. Almost. I turned my W on like one auto earlier. I could have gotten him. He's just gonna TV back, so. Let's try to clear it fast. Yeah. Time to go. Start going into my Triforce. Wait a little bit of gold. Get this. I don't want to teleport. The wave's pushing out, right? Ooh. It's pushing out to me, but it's worth teleporting. Pushing out to me, it's just going to take too long to do so. So it's better just to TP in this situation to make sure I get all six. It was going to push out to me, but it's going to take too long. That's really, really sucks. Am I going to have to flash? Okay. 
That's pretty unfortunate. He's gonna just stay, so. Should. I don't know. I'm Aurelia. I want to outplay. So. <laughs> I'll play it Aurelia. I just want to make the outplays. Uh, 18 health on one, like nothing on the other. What are you gonna do, man? Oh man, look at this idiot. I mean, that's really matter. He's just gonna back anyways. So. <laughs> it's not like he really lost that much. He just, lo I probably lost like 10 seconds, right? Because we take eight seconds from the back. I mean, he's running away for probably another five seconds. Honestly, it's probably like the same. Literally, probably the same as if he just. Ran away and back. Probably about the same time. Ugh, unfortunate. No renekton unfollowed. See ya. Alright, peace, man. <laughs> Alright. I mean, once I get a couple levels, it'll be much easier. Like, you get level 7 and you win. Level 6, you win. A little bit annoying to deal with jungle pressure, but, I mean, I had jungle pressure earlier, so. Complain when the enemy matches it. Ooh, hello. Pink ward when you have no wave control. Interesting. Not very good. So you see how I like chunked him out to literally no HP in like one trade? Yeah. When we trade with ultimate, it's much easier. But he has to be like farther out in the lane for that to really happen. I'm just gonna let this wave push out to me. I like walk away. I bet it'll be stupid. And yeah, I bet it'll just like hard push. Thinking I left. Oh, obviously. You suck. Bro, you're literally missing a bunch of creeps to do nothing here. <laughs> like, so I'm just getting constantly pressured out by this lead. Hopefully my team's doing other stuff on the rest of the map. My bot win is winning really hard. <laughs> I, I can't push up anymore because he's... For all I know, he could literally just repeat and just be right here. So, the wave shoving out to me, I just got to be patient and wait. Getting camped, so... The less I die, the better. Just got to sit back, relax. If he's going to focus me this hard, there's really not much I can do. It's going to affect me, obviously. Just gonna look to shove in. Good job. Oh, I leveled it up and I didn't activate it. <laughs> okay. I was like, what the hell? Why did my Q not kill that creep? It's because I leveled my W. I didn't actually turn it on. I'm just gonna wait for my ult and clear this wave out real fast. Or actually, I might not even have to. kind of what I'm talking about. Every time I see him, I'm just going to literally chunk him out to no HP. So It's kind of going to just keep happening. I don't really... He bought Merc Treads, so that's going to help against my E, I guess. <laughs> I don't really see the value, to be completely honest, but... Eh. Whatever. I mean, my E's magic damage, so... I don't know. Maybe he thinks I'm like E-maxing or some shit, but <laughs> I'm not. I'm just maxing W, so I'm going to tear him up. He has no health right now. He has 80 health from this, so... He has no way of stopping my true damage, so when I Q him with my W up, or when I just have my W up and I'm auto attacking, he's just going to get absolutely wrecked. So at this point, there's like really not much you can do to fight me. And I got a four creep wave, or four creep advantage that I can freeze. There it is. And now I got TP to make a play if he tries to go anywhere. Oops. So I just look to freeze this out. 
Okay, please. Please don't walk under tower. My freeze will break if this walks under tower. It's so slight right now. I just gotta last hit like the last possible second. All these three have to die. Yeah, it's not gonna be a freeze. Uh, yeah, it's not gonna be a freeze because one of the melees is gonna live. All right, now I can just push. Whatever. Kind of like I said, dude, anytime I see him, I'm just going to completely shit on him. So, <laughs> like, he can do stuff in the early game, but at this point, this is basically how Aurelia works. Like, you get to this point when you have a few points into your W, a few points into your, uh, a few points into your E, and you just wreck people. I mean, W is what really matters. Once you get a couple points into your W, you just start tearing people up. Uh, oops. So I force this flash out of him. Force him out of lane again. And then even if he comes back, I'm just going to all in him again. I don't have to TP in. I'm just going to walk away. This isn't an actual fight. Yeah. Just walking under tower. That's all. That wasn't like an actual fight that was ever going to happen. That was a really bad teleport. I can just push this out. If I'm needed, I TP. Got level 9, so I got max points into my W now. So, I am a monster. Damn, son. That looks like it hurts. Still no reason for me to come. I can just keep pushing. I have TP. They're all super low, so it's not even like they can come top to deal with me. I'm just getting super free farm right now. Like, this is awesome. I'll just chill here forever. Free tower, free farm. He's missing all this minions. Cool. <laughs> cool with me, man. Cool with me. Uh-oh. And, th and then they died. I'll blow this dude up in a second. If he gets wise. Uh, what's his face was really low too. Wondering if he just like ults me into his buddy coming in. He's sticking around. I feel like uh, he's gonna try and set up a play with Yasuo where Lee just ults me and then Yasuo ults me. Oh, they have a Janna here. Interesting. What are you gonna do? We'll just take free towers in mid, man. I don't give a fuck. Set three people top. I don't care. I'm gonna TP on the creep. So just keep going. Oh, is there even gonna be a wave there? Oh yeah, this next one will come. Actually, kill this guy. I'm not sure. What's gonna end up happening is he's gonna eat off me. I'm gonna miss him with the A click into the bushes. Yeah, he's over there. Coming, friend. Uh oh. All me, baby. All me. <laughs> Dude, this game. This guy's just shitting on everybody. <laughs> Like, I absorbed all the jungle pressure, so that counts for something, but this guy's just wrecking everybody. What a beast. Oops. SRO cannon. Meanwhile, in mid lane, like, literally free pushing.
All right, take a tower. Let's back. Finish my items. Looking good. I mean, I'm O2, but <laughs> I'm fucking huge right now. I have a 30 CS lead, so obviously that counts for something. And then, like I said, dude, I'm obviously gonna be behind when I have to absorb all the fucking jungle pressure. Can he do it? The answer is no. <laughs> Alright. Real big right now. Real big. Got my Triforce finished. Got my extra movement speed. I'm running down. Looks like they're doing dragon. Yep. Okay, buddy. Oh my fucking god, I hate this game so much. That's such bullshit, dude. It's such bullshit. What, he actually went back in? I'm gonna get NATO'd in a second. Oh. You see me get blocked by that wall, by the cannon? Like what? Got to auto, dude. Make sure I don't die. That's all. That's all, friend. Whew. Seen that coming? I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm gone. Can maybe take that. Let me get the health right here. And just head top. There's a giant ass wave up there. I honestly think the health is better. Because they have a burst mage mid. Okay. Looking good. Come back to a huge creep wave. Look at how many minions are going to be up here. Uh oh. Uh, we don't want to be here. Two against four. That's not a smart idea. Scratch that. Make that two against five. <laughs> Not the smart idea. Alright. Get this pushed in. Nice. Pressure, pressure, pressure. It's the name of the game, boys. Too many replay reviews I watch when I'm doing my coaching. Like... Constantly, people just don't go into side lanes ever. What, what do you What do you see me do when I play? I'm like literally living in the side lane. I don't care about the rest of the fucking map. I'm constantly pressuring the side lanes, so we get advantages. Especially with TP out. There's so many times I, I do coaching commentaries and I see people with TP available, and then they just run down mid immediately. It's like, dude, what do you think that TP is for? So you can pressure out those side lanes. Hmm. I can go like this then. Back head bot. Got to pee. So I can 1v1 wreck this kid right now. So obviously I want to pressure a side lane. Force two people to come to me potentially. And then my team wins 4v4. If not, I TP in. We win 5v4. I mean, we win 5v5, so you can make the case like, hey, Mike, why don't you just group up and win? It's like, meh. Because this is much, this is like guaranteed. If we group up under tower, I don't know, it's not like fully guaranteed. Because they can wave clear a little bit, so. I mean, their wave clear kind of sucks, to be honest, but. I think it's just better to pressure out multiple sides. And when they come in, we just TP in. I literally did nothing there, but waste their time. That's all I did. But see, if I stayed bottom now, we'd have the wave like shoved in the tower, and we could just rotate there. 
See how like unlikely it is for us to like actually finish something? Whereas if I was pushing bottom and they didn't fight, it would have been much better. I'm here. <laughs> Stunned forever, dude. The lovely low HP Aurelia. Gotta love it. I got old right now. I can just get full HP off this next wave. Really good pressure. Actually, surprised this guy isn't staying mid. That sucks. <laughs> well, this sucks. Alright. All by myself. <laughs> so I fell right there, dude. <laughs> I'm over here trying to save your ass. And ditch me. Yeah, we shouldn't have went for it. I should have just. I knew. I knew we weren't gonna get it because MF already left. So I don't know. We don't have the damage or the. Yeah, we don't have the damage to finish it. Not enough attack speed. If we had her over there, psh, we'd get it easy. I mean, it's a thousand damage. It's nothing. Legendary. She had Maw? No, she just wrecks the guy? Okay. <laughs> Interesting. He's all mid. Five. Mid. All we have to do is five mid, then we go get a side lane after. After we get that pressure going in the mid lane with the supers. Then we can start worrying about side lane pressure. They are scared as fuck. They don't want to come with me. They don't want to battle me. No, in reality, they're afraid of MF, who is nearby. Demolished, chunked out. It should be relatively free. Then we can just go to a side lane. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind, this guy could just hit a binding. <laughs> That'll work too, I guess. Yeah, we're just gonna head bot here. Get this tower. Guy messed up a bit, took like half his HP and damage. Can't actually kill me, so. Let's just leave. Giant wave in top. And there's a dragon to do. Oh. I'll see you later. I'm gonna go get that top wave. On my way. Yeah, you can just go do that. Yeah, you should definitely just go do it. Good idea. My score is so shit, dude. It looks way worse than it. I oh, don't know. Whatever. I don't give a fuck. They put all the pressure on me, dude. Obviously, my score is going to look like shit. I got all the Lee ganks. I'm, I'm not saying that one bottom their lane. Like, they were already doing really good by themselves. They, like, won just 2v2. So, good on them. But I did absorb the jungle pressure. For so long. And I was still way stronger than my opponent 1v1 anyways. It wasn't like just because I was getting... I don't know why we're here. Yo. Top lane, boys. Top, please.
up. Probably went off that. Wow. I'm like literally one one HP away from being able to one shot back creeps. It's so annoying. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm a rally. You know what happens when I'm low HP? Y'all die. <laughs> Y'all get stunned for eight hours and die. This dude is dead too. He's getting E'd right there. Turn my W on. Well, bam, well, bam, well, bam, dead. Alright, I didn't really have to do too much that game. I mean, I just got camped, tried to survive, and, uh, I don't know, just trying to stay relevant. I mean, at no point could the Yasuo 1v1 me. Okay, that's a lie. Outside of, like, the first few levels, which is when you're supposed to lose as Aurelia. After I hit, like, level, what, 5 or level 6 or whatever, there's, like, nothing you could really do anymore. Unless Lee and... Well, the only time I died after that was when Lee and Janna were there, and I, like, went into the bait because I was an asshole. <laughs> but, yeah, fun game. Team did really well. I just kind of absorbed pressure and farmed, and then we won. Yay. So GG, well played. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. Thanks for watching. Make sure to tune in next time. Peace.